All right, guys, this is Jason with LPV Model. Hi. And today I'm going to show you how to connect this, the X Racer version 3.0 with SPI, to this, uh, the FR Sky X4R with S Bus Receiver. It's relatively straightforward and it's about as headache free as something can get in the RC industry. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to be using this, the X Racer, that is fully pinned out just to, in order to make my life a little bit easier. So I'll go ahead and uh, set up the Clean Flat configurator and show you how to connect this receiver and get everything set up. Okay, so to make this easy enough, we're just going to take a typical uh, servo cable connect it to the S bus pins on the X4R. Just make sure you have the uh, have it plugged into the bottom ones. And then take the other end and connect it directly to the S bus spot on the flight controller. Now let's go ahead and move over to clean flight. Okay, now with those connected, we're just gonna go ahead and uh, plug in the USB and move on over to clean flight. So let's go ahead and connect the USB to the x ray flight controller here and one of the things you'll notice is you'll notice that the uh, X4R receiver also lights up. Uh, that's because we've made this board in a way so that whenever, even when you just plug power in from the USB it will also power the receiver. Uh, this makes the connection in clean flight and setting up your uh, transmitter and things a little bit easier. Uh, this way you don't even have to connect the battery. So we'll go ahead and uh, go into clean flight as you can see here and connect. And then the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into ports. And whenever you go into ports, go down to UART 3 that you see here and just turn on serial RX and then save and reboot. Uh, just takes a moment, you'll see the lights flash over on the board. Uh, once you save that, you can move into configuration. And then you need to go to RX serial. Uh, you see here the serial base receivers, specs at SBUS, Sunday. Uh, that's where you're going to connect. And then you will also highlight on SBUS. Uh, make sure that's clicked on and then save and reboot once again. Uh, once you save and reboot, and you should be good to go. So let's just go ahead and turn on the transmitter. Uh, we have bound Welcome this. Uh, we've already bound the receiver to the transmitter. Which warning? So let's just go on over here to receiver and move the sticks around and you'll see that everything's working, uh, that everything's working. So let's go ahead and uh, disconnect the board and next video we'll go ahead and uh, hook some other things up to this and show you some of the other functions with it. Uh, if you have any questions or you would like to, uh, you'd like us to answer any questions in one of these videos, please uh, let me know. You can either send me a message, Jason at FPV Model, or just uh, leave a comment in the comment section. Thanks for watching.